the Katsina state government says it has recorded no fewer than 118 suspected cases of cholera disease across the state. To this end, the state government says it is adopting strategies to prevent the spread of the disease and order vaccines preventable outbreaks across the state. Abdullahi Yamadi completes the report. This is not the first time the state government is coming out to announce outbreaks of diseases, but this latest pronouncement appears more serious due to the danger cholera poses whenever it strikes. The Kazuma State Primary Health Care Agency officials appeared a bit disturbed, saying they are fully prepared to cut short the spread of the epidemic and manage cases already recorded. Beyond that, the government said it has activated its incidence management system to effectively tame this couch in the next couple of days. You know, when you have disease, normally, uh, one of the best practice globally is the activation of incident management system. And this system entails, you know, a coordinated approach using, using different strategies. One of the best practices that we use is issue of strengthening surveillance, which I've already discussed, uh, issue of uh, detecting cases promptly, then other issues of uh, laboratory, we have groups that are in charge of that. Uh, others is the infection prevention and control. We want to ensure that this infection, if it happens, it doesn't really spread. Though no life has been lost following the outbreak, the government says that you for comprehensive health centers with cholera treatment units and centers have been designated for admission and treatment of the victims. The incidence manager, director in the Katmandu State Primary Health Care Agency, Kabir Suleiman, said, "Besides this, the government is also looking at some alternatives such as improvement in wash facilities, solarization, and rehabilitation of boreholes across the state." As you are aware. Is one of the states that is termed as high risk for uh, cholera based on the global tax force uh, on, uh, on uh, GTFCC, the global tax force for uh, cholera control. Katsina has 10 of its LGAs that are termed very high risk. Funtua, Jibia, Basari, and Mamshan and few. So these are areas that we are really focusing. We have designated 34 comprehensive health centers for receiving, uh, for admission of cases of cholera. Global Task Force for Cholera Control shows that Kazana has 10 of its local government areas termed as high risk with Funtua, Basari, and Jibia topping the list. Public commentators view this task as challenging considering the fact that more than half of the local government areas in Kazana state are prone to insecurity. Abdullahi Izumayamadi, Trust Television News, Kazina.